Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you, Marisha? Fine, thank you. presentando tanto problema en la plataforma. I have no idea. The thing <laughs> is that um you know the guys uh, that are doing that uh, they're supposed to be checking that up. Um that a lot uh, it seems like a lot of people have been complaining about that to to Inglés Corporativo. So Inglés Corporativo is working on that. Okay. So today because uh, you only have by tomorrow to finish the test so I'm, I'm going to to be talking about the test today i'm going to be explaining some things bueno voy a poder voy a hacer lo que lo que me acepte porque algunas cosas no las acepta no sé por qué de la plataforma yeah Teacher. Hey, good evening, good evening. Welcome to the class. Yeah, like I said, um, many things are are way different in the platform um, and they are not working. I don't know why, uh, it, but, but it's the people who's making the platform, who's doing the platform. That does, that's not actually, you know, it's not English Corporativo, it's, it's, it's somebody else. Thank you. Okay, so, so far we have only four students. Um, that's the thing, that's another thing, like if in, the, um, in the module, there are more than 30 students subscribed, more than 30 students. And to the class, to the virtual crafts, they only come no more than 14. I don't know why, that's really weird.
like there should be more than 20 students on, in the class, but there's so little students, so, so few. Se habrán ido algunos. No, they, 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 they are subscribed. Están inscritos en el módulo, but mm. to the class they don't come. They don't come to the class. But when they need help, yes, they, they ask for help. Okay, guys, so we're already, uh, let, let's start because I'm not going to be waiting for everybody for, you know, we have to do a lot anyways. Okay, so in the name of English Corporativo, I'm welcoming you to my class. And remember that English Corporativo is the one who is actually accessing to your, um, to your scholarship so you can do this, um, this models, okay? So let's begin, guys. As you can see, I'm, I'm already showing my, my my PowerPoint presentation, which is the final test. Today, we're going to be talking about the final test. Let me put this down, yes. Let me put this down. All right, that's much better. Okay, as I was telling you, I'm going to be talking or explaining more about um, the final test. So in this case, you're going to check that the final test is going to be like, um, like, like, like I'm going to explain how it's supposed to be, but I'm hearing that in the platform, everybody's having some troubles. Let's check it out. Okay, let's see. So let's check what it's all about. So the first part that we have in the, in the platform is the listening, okay, the listening. So in this case, what we need to do is to listen to this and then we answer. So, for example, we're going to do the first part, okay? In number one, we have Emily is short and in her 30s. Emily is medium height and in her 20s. Emily is fairly short and about 25. So you're going to be looking for either of those when you listen, okay? And let's see, number two, Steve has blue eyes and black hair. Steve is really tall and has curly brown hair. Steve is only 29 years old and handsome. So let's see. Let's listen. Pay attention, please. Can you listen to this? Check the Is everybody listening? Um, no. Uh, no, listen. No. The volume. Wait, did you listen to that? No. No. Okay, let me do one more thing. Wait, let me check something up. Let me just share it with sound and optimize sharing for video clip. Okay, let's see. Let's see this way. Okay. Good, 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 good. Now let's go here. Okay, listen. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct information. One. Excuse me. I'm looking for someone. I'm meeting her for lunch here. Her name is Emily Black. All right. What does she look like? Let's see. She's about 25, I guess. Look over there. Is she the one with the long black hair? Uh, no, that's not her. Emily's fairly short and has... Oh, I think I see her. Look, she's waving at you. Two. Sarah. Did you hear that Judy has a new boyfriend? No, I didn't. What's he like? Well, 
His name's Steve, and he's very nice. And he's tall, really tall. He's over six feet tall. What color is his hair? His hair is blonde and curly. He sounds very handsome. He is, and he's the same age as Judy. So he's only 19? Yes, that's right. Three. Oh, wait, 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 wait. All right, Mr. Brown. Tell me again what happened. Okay, so number one, what is the answer? Emily is short and in her 30s. Emily is medium high and in her 20s. Emily is fairly short and about 25. Three. Number three. Three. Emily is fairly three. short and about 25. Okay, so three. Emily is fairly short three. and about 25. And number two, what is a Steve? Number uh, two. Steve number is two. really tall <laughs> and has curly blonde hair. So it's number two. Steve is really tall and has curly blonde hair. Okay? Yes. Cool. Yes. Let's Teacher. Go number three. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct information. One. Excuse me, I'm looking for someone from the back of her chair. Judy, so he's only 19? Yes, that's right. Three. All right, Mr. Brown, tell me again what happened here. Thank you, officer. I told you, the man took my wife's purse from the back of her chair. We were at this table. <coughs> what did the thief look like? I told you he was elderly. He was maybe in his 70s. And about how tall was he? You mean how short was he? He was short, only about five feet tall. What else do you remember? Well, he had on baggy pants and a red t-shirt. He also had a white beard. Four. Hi, I'm new here. My name's Sharon. I'm Charlie. Welcome to our school party. Do you want something to eat? Not right now, thanks. Actually, I'm looking for AJ and Penny. I need their phone number. Which ones are they? They're that good-looking couple sitting on the couch. Oh, I see them, thanks. And one more thing. Is Clara here? I need to ask her a question about her homework for tomorrow. Let me see. Oh, yes, I see her. She's wearing jeans and a red sweater. She's standing over there talking to Tom. Okay, so what is number three? Number one. Number one. The thief was short, thief was had a short. white beard, and was elderly. Okay, very good. And number four? Number two. Number three. Number Num three. Wait, wait, wait. Number two or number three? Number three. Number two. two. Number two. two. It's number two. AJ and Penny are both wearing jeans and red sweater. Good. Mm. Oh, or you want to listen one more time? Okay, let's listen one more time then, to number four. Listen to the conversation. He's over six feet tall. He is. And he's the same age as Judy. So he's only 19? Yes, that's right. Three. All right, Mr. Brown, tell me again what happened here. Thank you, officer. I told you, the man took my wife's purse from the back of her chair. We were at this table. What did the thief look like? I told you he was elderly. He was maybe in his 70s. And about how tall was he? You mean how short was he? He was short, only about five feet tall. What else do you remember? Well. He had on baggy pants and a red t-shirt. He also had a white beard. Four. Hi, I'm new here. My name's Sharon. I'm Charlie. Welcome to our school party. Do you want something to eat? Not right now, thanks. Actually, I'm looking for AJ and Penny. I need their phone number. Which ones are they? They're that good-looking couple sitting on the couch. Oh, I see them, thanks. And one more thing. Is Clara here? I need to ask her a question about her homework for tomorrow. Let me see. Oh, yes, I see her. She's wearing jeans and a red sweater. She's standing over there talking to Tom. Okay, so what do you think now? Is two or three? It's number three. It's number three, definitely. Yes, 
because the the one uh, wearing jeans is uh, they're talking about other other mm -hmm. other people okay so AJ and Penny are the attractive couple sitting on the couch okay okay all right let's move on instructions complete the conversations use the present perfect of the verbs so the verb be what is the present perfect or of, of be being being very good so what is number one have you been to any good movie lately very good have you been to any good movie lately very good okay and number uh, well b letter b yes i have yes i have already so no so is simple past so is I yeah yeah seen uh, seen very good seen. yes i have already seen the film this month three films this month seen s e e n s double -E, e n okay okay so let's go for number 2 a he ever eaten thai food before have has has very good has he ever eaten thai food before yes very good and B? Had. had. Had, very good. No, he has never had it in his life. No, he, ha he has never had it in his life. Everything good? Yes. yes. Oh, okay. Let's move on. Instructions, read the sentences and choose the correct answer. Let's see, choose the correct answer. Number one. I lived in Boston five years. I loved every Ford. minute I was there. What is it? Ford. Yeah, Ford. Ford. I lived in Boston for five years. I loved every minute I was there. Number two, my wife and I have gone to Costa Rica every year, 2001. Since. 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 Very good. Three, Patrick has studied Portuguese a long time. He's a good speaker now. Four. 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 Okay. Very good. Okay. Moving on. Next instructions. Read the following sentences and choose the correct word. So this one we're going to choose the correct word. My brother is his twenties and goes to college in Arizona. In. In. My brother is in his twenties. Yes. In. Number two, Tracy short, straight black hair and blue eyes. Has. 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 Very good. Has. has. Three, first nephew, five feet, eight, and has dark brown beard and mustache. Is. Is. Very good. First nephew is five feet, eight, and has dark brown beard and mustache. Very good. Has. Instructions, read the following sentences and choose the correct word. Always choosing the correct word, guys. So, has, has Martin ever an appointment? It has never ever lost. No, missed. Number one, missed. Uh, missed. Has Martin ever missed an appointment? Mm -hmm. Five, how many times have you lost your... Cell phone. cell phone. Cell phone. How many times have you lost your cell phone? Very good. Um, have you ever a truck? Uh, driving. Driving. Driven. 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 It's very simple. Driven. Have you ever driven a truck? Okay. Very good. Moving on. Let's see what's next. Instructions, put the words in the correct order to make sentences or questions. Number one is gorgeous, is gorgeous, is gorgeous, 30s and Christy, her really in. So what is the answer here? Christy is in her 30s and really gorgeous. Yes, very good. Christy is in her 30s and really gorgeous. What does it mean, gorgeous? 
Muy bonita, hermosa. Yeah. Hermosa, bella. Ok, very good. Cool, cool. Ok, number two. Wear mustache, have sun, a dos glasses in. Anybody, anybody. Dos have, dos have. No. Dos have. Dos Sam have, 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 do, have dos. a mustache and wear glasses. Yes, dos, yes, yes. The son, the son have a mustache and wear glasses. The son have mustache and wear glasses. Number three, red, Cindy, high, long, has, and is medium hair. Cindy is medium hair and has a long red hair. And has long, long red hair. Cindy is medium height and has long, long black. Red. Long, 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 red. No, long red. red. Long red hair. Yes, yes, very good. So Cindy is medium high and has red, long red hair. Long red hair. Okay, everybody. Okay. Cool, cool. Cindy is medium hair. Medium height and has long red hair. Long red hair. Very good. Very good. Nice. Nice. I think only I have one student. Okay. Number four. Mm -hmm. One person next Jason couch. Who's the sitting two? Who's Jason? Nope. Who's the person? Who's the person? Yes. Who's the person? Sitting. Sitting. To the, sitting to the couch. No, 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 no. Sitting. Sitting on the couch. No, 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 no. Next to. Next to Jason. Who's the person next sitting room. next to Jason on the couch? Who's the person sitting next to Jason on the couch? Who's the person sitting next to Jason on the couch? Got it? Got okay. it. Cool. All right, let's move on. Ooh, this one, we need to understand the whole uh, thing here in the reading. Instruction, read Sarah's email, then check four things she can do in her neighborhood. Okay, let's begin. Everybody, let's begin with me. Hi, Nina. Guess what? I move into my new apartment yesterday. Everybody. Hi, Nina. Hi, Hi Nina. Guess what? I moved, I moved into, into my, my new apartment, apartment yesterday. yesterday. Very good. Wait, 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 wait. I, I, I moved into my new apartment yesterday. So he's saying, what he's saying in Spanish? Eh, que se mudó a su nuevo apartamento el día de ayer. And what is, guess what? What does that mean? Guess what? Como adivina que. que. Adivina que. Very good. Very good. I just, I just need to make sure that you understand 100%. Okay? Let's move on. I really like my new roommates. Everybody? I really like my new roommates. I really like my new roommates. I really like my new roommates. And what, what is that in Spanish? Uh, en verdad me caen bien mis nuevos compañeros de cuarto. Me caen bien. I like. Ok. Moving on. I also like the neighborhood. Everybody. I also like the neighborhood. I also like the neighborhood. I also like the neighborhood. 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 Okay. And what is that in Spanish? Yes, y también me gusta el vecindario. Very good. There are lots of different restaurants here. Everybody? There are lots of different restaurants here. There are lots of different restaurants here. 
There are lots, there are lots, lots of different of restaurants, different here. restaurants here. Okay, so what is that in Spanish? Hay muchos diferentes Hay bastantes. Okay, very good. Last night I ate at Vietnamese restaurant just around the corner. Last night, Last I, night ate I ate at, I ate a, at Vietnamese, Vietnamese restaurant just around, around, around the corner. Around the corner. Last night I ate at a Vietnamese restaurant just around the corner. Last, Last night, night, I ate, I ate at the Vietnamese, Vietnamese restaurant just around the corner. corner. Just around the corner. So what is that in Spanish? Anoche. 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 En un restaurante de Vietnamese. Justo a la vuelta de la esquina. Justo. Justo a la vuelta de la esquina. Excellent. Excellent. Very good. Very good. The food was delicious. The food, the food was, was, was delicious. delicious. The food was delicious. The food, the was, food, delicious. Was, delicious. The food was delicious. La comida estaba delicious. delicious. Very good. And I want to try a new Brazilian restaurant near here. And, mm -hmm. and I want to try a new Brazilian restaurant near here. Near here. And I want to try a new Brazilian restaurant near here. And I want to try a new Brazilian restaurant near here. What is that in Spanish? Que quiere probar a nuevo restaurante brasileño que está cerca de ahí. Cerca de ahí. Okay, very good, very good. For breakfast this morning, I came to this great coffee shop across my apartment. For breakfast, for breakfast this morning, morning I came to this, this great, great, great coffee, coffee shop, shop across my apartment. apartment. For breakfast this morning, I came to this great coffee shop across from my apartment. For breakfast, for breakfast this morning, this morning I, came I came to this, this great, great coffee shop, shop across, from my, across from my apartment. Okay, so what is that in Spanish? Para el para 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 esta mañana. Mañana a una buena cafetería. Cruzando, cruzando su apartamento, cruzando su apartamento. Eric. Actually, it's an internet cafe, so I'm emailing you now. Everybody. Actually, it's an internet cafe. I am emailing you now. Actually, it's an internet cafe. So I'm emailing you now. Actually, Very good. So what is that in Spanish? Realmente, realmente es un cibercafé y que le está escribiendo le va a enviar un correo le está enviando le está enviando un email en este momento pero la palabra actually cómo comprenden la palabra actually en este momento en realidad no 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 de hecho de hecho de hecho, de hecho. De hecho. De hecho. okay very good let's move on it's a really convenient neighborhood. It's a really convenient neighborhood. Everybody? It's a really it's convenient, really convenient, really convenient, convenient neighborhood. neighborhood. Convenient. 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 Neighborhood. Convenient. Okay, and what, what's that in Spanish? En realidad es un vecindario bien ubicado. Mm, muy conveniente. conveniente. Muy conveniente. Muy conveniente. Yes, very good. There's a laundromat on our street, and there are some interesting stores too. There's a laundromat on our, our street, street, and there are some interesting stores too. Two. <laughs> okay. There's a laundromat on our street, and there are some interesting stores too. Everybody? There's, there's a lot of on our street. Okay, and what is that in Spanish? 
Que hay una lavandería, dice. Este, en su eh, calle. En la calle, en la calle. Ajá. Que hay algunas tiendas eh, interesantes. Interesante. También. También. Ok, very good, very good. También. One store sells lots of amazing DVDs, DVDs and books from all over the world. Everybody. One store sells lots of amazing CDs, DVDs, and books from all over the world. Everybody. One store sells lots of amazing CDs, DVDs, and books from all over the world. And what is that in Spanish? Unas tiendas venden una tienda, vende, una tienda, una tienda, venden muchos CDs, DVDs, libros increíbles, libros. todo el mundo. Todo el mundo. Very good. Okay, nice. And my roommates told me there's a dance club just two blocks away. In my, my roommates told me there's a dance club just two blocks away. Two blocks away. Every weekend. And my roommates told me there's a dance club just two blocks away. And, and my roommate, roommate told me there's a dance club just two blocks away. away. Okay, eh, cuando digan dance club, no digan de, dance club, digan dance club, dance club. Dance club. Dance club. Dance club. Okay, and what is that club. in Spanish? What, what is that in Spanish? Eh, y mis compañeros de cuarto me dijeron que hay un club de baile, de baile. justo dos cuadras, dos cuadras, de, dos cuadras de, como dos cuadras de, de ahí, dos, dos, dos cuadras, cuadras, cuadras de ahí, de ahí. A dos cuadras de ahí, very good, a dos cuadras, a dos cuadras de ahí, de ahí, okay. I want to go dancing every weekend. I want to go dancing every weekend. Dancing every weekend. Every weekend. Come visit, Sarah. Come visit, Sarah. Come visit, Sarah. Okay, now that we understand the whole thing, we're going to see what's going on. What, what are the questions? Let's see. Sarah can. Ahora, Sarah puede. ¿Cuál de todas? Go, go dancing. Read books. Go, go dancing. Shopping. 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 Uh, wash and dry clothes. Wash, wash and dry clothes. Uh huh. What the else? Dancing teacher. Yeah, yes. Send emails. Yes. Yes. Send emails. Very good. Very good. Okay. So that's about it. Read books. Uh, go dancing. Go shopping. Uh, send emails. An email. And wash and dry clothes. Okay. No. Okay. Very good. All right. Let's see next. I can participate a little teacher. Okay, um, so we finished. We finished already. Teacher, I can yep. participate a little. I don't feel so well. No, it's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Just you can be just listening. Don't worry. Okay. Okay. Thank, thank you. Okay. Uh, so everybody else, do you have any questions about anything that we just seen in in the test? Algo que tengan que preguntar sobre el sobre el sobre el test, no? Everything understood? Yes. yes. Very good. Okay, I like that. So let's move on. Vamos a continuar donde nos quedamos. Okay, ¿en qué nos quedamos ayer? What, what we, where we left off yesterday? Where we left off yesterday? ¿Se acuerdan? 5.8 creo que era. No. 5.6. 5.6, esta, ¿verdad? Yes. Uh -huh. How long have you been waiting in line? Yeah. Yes, yes. ¿Qué fue que practicamos? ¿Qué, ¿Qué practicamos con esa? No se acuerdan. El present perfect and simple, simple past. past. Present perfect. Hicimos eh, el simple past versus el present perfect. Ok, so allí fue donde practicamos eso. Ok, very good. So let's go to 5.7. 5.7, achievement indicator. In this lesson, participants will learn when to use present perfect versus simple past. Everybody. 
five points, five points seven, seven achievement in the indicator, indicator. The lesson lesson participants will learn, learn when to use the perfect, perfect, perfect versus simple, simple pass. pass. Simple pass. Very good. Let's see. Okay. Have you ever gone hiking? 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 Yes, I have. I went hiking once to Chaparrastique Volcano. No, I haven't. Everybody. Yes, I have. I went hiking once to Chaparrastique Volcano. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. Have you ever have you ever eaten garrobo? <laughs> have, have you ever eaten garrobo? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. No, I haven't. I haven't. Yes, I have. I tried it once at a restaurant in Usulután. Yes, I have. I tried it in the restaurant in Usulután. Have you ever had chaparro? 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 Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. It is very strong drink. Yes, I have. have. It is yeah, a very, it's a very strong drink. drink. Have you ever played American football? Have you ever, have you ever played, played American, football? American football? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Yes, yes I, I have. have. No, I have. Good, good, good. Okay. Um, any questions in this in this slide? Questions, questions. How do you say volcano? Volcano. 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 Okay. All right. Any other question? Mm. Hiking. 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 Escalar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Any other question? No question. Okay. A screenshot to practice. A screenshot to practice. You got the screenshot? No, no. Got it. Okay. Good. It. good. So let's move on. Let's see what is next. Okay, 5.10, achievement indicator in this session, the use of four ensigns will be explained throughout an audio. Know the expression. Everybody? Good, let's move on. Okay, how long have you worked for INSA4? How long have you worked for INSA4? Everybody. How long have you worked work for INSA4? For INSA4. Okay. I have worked for INSA4 for more than 10 years. I have worked I have for INSA4 for more than 10 years. I have never worked for INSA4. How long have you lived in the U.S.? How long, How long, long have you lived in the U.S.? How long have you lived in the U.S.? How long have you lived in the U.S.? U.S. 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 I have lived in the U.S. for 12 years. I have, I have, lived, have lived, lived in the U.S. The US for 12 years. years. How long have you been teaching English? 
How long have you been teaching English? I have been teaching English for 15 years. I have been teaching English for 15 years. How long have you been engaged? 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 I have been engaged for three years. I have been engaged for three years. We have been engaged for five years. We have been engaged for five years. Very good. All right, any questions here in this slide? Questions, questions. Uh, in, engage. What is engage? Anybody remember? Engage. Comprometido. Thank you very much. Comprometido or comprometida. Okay. Anybody else? Any questions? Okay, we're good. A screenshot, please. A screenshot. A screenshot. <laughs> okay, you have the screenshots? Yes. Okay, let's go. Let's go to practice. Let's see. Practice, 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 practice. Okay, uh, remember, yes, make sure that your classmate is making the right um, um, pronunciation. And if you listen, just make corrections, okay? Co work together. What happened to Firulai? What's going on? <laughs> Poor Firulai, man. Three to four, there he was. Only three, three groups. Okay, go to your groups and start working. Okay. Okay, eh, Veronica, <laughs> mi tocaya. <laughs> have you ever gone hiking? Yes, I have. I have. I went hiking once to Chaparro City Volcano. Volcano. No, I Volcano. 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 No, I, no, I haven't. Eh, have you ever eaten a robo? Yes, I I have. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. I have been one at restaurant in Sultan. Have you ever had Chaparro? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Yes, I, I have. It, it is a very strong dream. Mm -hmm. Have you ever played American football? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Okay. Ahora usted pregunte a mí. Have you ever been going high? Hiking. Hiking. Yes, I have. I went hiking once to Chaparastique Volcano. And no, I haven't. Have you ever been a robo? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. I tried it once at a restaurant in Usulután. Have you ever, ever had chaparro? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. It is a very strong dream. Have you ever played American football? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Eh, sí. Ahora veamos la otra, ¿verdad? No, ah, sí. La 5.11. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. How long have you worked for in Safar? Worked. 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 I, I work for Isa for, for more than 10 years. Sí. Eh. Sí, 
Josabet, how long have you worked for insert form? No work it. Work. Work. No. Remember, work. When, when it's simple pass or part participle, ya que termine en ed o e o de, se pronuncia con t al final. No se dice work, work. it. It's work. Work it. Work. 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 Okay. How long have you worked for insert I have worked for Insafor for more than 10 years. I have never worked for Insafor. Just that I, I, I don't have the picture there, the screenshot. I told you guys to get the screenshot. Okay, can somebody, um, um, I mean, can you guys uh, share the, the screenshot, please? Joseph, can you? Mm -hmm. Wait. Yo creo ya la mandé al grupo. Okay, okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, um, just a bit. How long have you lived in the U.S.? I have lived in the U.S. for 12 years. Godofredo, how long have you been teaching English? I have been teaching English for uh, 50 years. 50? 15 years. Oh, mm -hmm. Be careful with the numbers. <laughs> <laughs> A ver, este, Flor... How long have you been engaged? In, engaged, engaged. Engaged. I have been engaged for three years. We have been engaged for five years. Okay, um, Josabeth, how long have you worked for Insafor? I have worked for Insafor for more than 10 years. I have never worked for Insafor. Godofredo, how long have you lived in the U.S.? I have lived in the U.S. for 12 years. Uh, Flor, how long have you been teaching English? I have been teaching English for 16 years. Hola, hola. Vas a pasar. Perdón, teacher. It's okay, don't worry. Okay, is everybody yet here? Let me see, I have nine students only. Okay, good. Um, guys, so as you can see, uh, there we were having um, this, this little practice. So what we're going to do is that we're going to explain something. Um, you know, eat and drink. For example, you can say, I eat dinner. But you can also say, I have dinner, and it means the same thing, okay? I eat dinner, 
and take and dinner. I have dinner. No, no take. Have. Have. No take dinner. No, no take. Have. Have, have dinner. dinner. Okay. 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 Thank you. Thank so, you. Thank you. Thank you. Eat dinner and have dinner is the same. Okay, that's with the verb eat. Also works with the verb with the verb drink. Drink a soda or have a soda is the same thing. Okay, so and I'm saying this because in one of in five point uh, five point eight. I ask you, have you ever had chaparro? ¿Has alguna vez tomado chaparro? Have you ever had? That's why. So you can say, eh, do you have chaparro? Or do, do you drink chaparro? That's, that's how you do it. So it's the same thing with eat and drink. You can use have, okay? And it means the same thing, okay? So let's do a little exercise just before we go. Let's do a little exercise about it, but using have, okay? So, a little question, teacher. let's use the, the six tenses. Let's use the six tenses. Number one, we're going to use eat. No, we're going to use drink with, with have, okay? So, let's do the six tenses. Present continuous. What is the, the general question for the present continuous? What are, what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, if I want to say I'm drinking chaparro, I'm drinking chaparro, what would be with the verb have? What have you? No, 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 no. No. In, pre in present continuous, in present continuous, what would be estoy tomando uh, chaparro? What are you drinking? Having, I am drinking chaparro. No, yo sabe, yo sabe co. Having chaparro. I'm, I'm having chaparro. I'm, I'm having chaparro. So it's the same mm -hmm. as saying I'm drinking chaparro. So you say I'm having chaparro. I'm having chaparro. Mm -hmm. so es, es lo mismo, significa lo mismo. Estoy tomando chaparro. I'm having chaparro. Okay, good. So that's present continuous. Let's do simple future. Simple future. General question, simple future. I will have no, 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 no. The question. And will is not, it's ah. not, it's not, it's not simple. What are you going to drink? What are you going to drink? No. What are you going? The general to question. Drink. The general question. Um, what are you going to drink? What, Joseph? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? What to are do. you going to do? No, 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 no. What the general question, no. Las la preguntas generales no llevan verbo porque necesitamos saber el verbo. Por eso son generales. Okay. So, what are you going to do? Ah, Esa es la pregunta. Everybody, what are you going to do? What, what are you going, going to do? do? Okay. Y como decimos, yo voy a tomar chaparro, pero con, con have. I am going to have chaparro. There you go. I am going to have chaparro. Y es lo mismo que dijéramos, I am going to drink chaparro. Okay? I am going to have chaparro. That's it. Okay? Simple pass. General question for simple pass. What did you do? What did you do? Thank you, Joseph. What did you do? What did you do? And what would be the answer? Uh, yo tomé chaparro, but with hat. I had chaparro. Thank you, Michelle. I had chaparro. Had. Yo tomé chaparro. I had chaparro. Es lo mismo que yo diga, I drank, because drank is, so I drank chaparro. Mm -hmm. So I had chaparro. Okay? Okay. Sí, simple present. General question. Simple present. What do you do? What do you do? And, como diría, yo tomo chaparro, pero con have. I have chaparro. I have chaparro. I, I have chaparro. Yo tomo chaparro. I have chaparro. There you go. Okay? Present perfect. General question. Present perfect. What have you done? What have you done? What have you? What have you done? What have you done? What have you done? And what would be the answer with, with have? Chaparro. 
I have had. I had had. I had had chaparro. I had had chaparro. Very good. And general question for past continuous. General question for past continuous. What were you doing? 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 Yes, what were you doing? And what would be the answer? I was having chaparro. There you go. I was having chaparro. It's the same thing of saying I was drinking chaparro. So I was having chaparro. Yes. Very good. Okay. And there you have it. Okay. See? What are you doing? I'm having chaparro. What are you going to do? I'm going to have chaparro. What did you do? I had chaparro. What do you do? I have chaparro. What have you done? I had had chaparro. And what were you doing? I was having chaparro. Repítamelo así como yo lo he hecho. Repítamelo. Oh, come on, you're not paying doing? attention. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. no. I am having chaparro. Guys, you're still sleeping. <laughs> What's going on? Okay. I am. I am having chaparro. <laughs> okay, guys. Okay, time's up. Time's up. So. I'm going to see you tomorrow. We're going to do another exercise with the six tenses, depending on what we see, okay? Tomorrow, I need you to finish uh, the, 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 the platform. Uh, when you finish, send me the screenshot of your, of your diploma, okay? When you finish, send me the screenshot of the, the, the diploma, put it in the group. Cuando terminen y, le, y tomen el diploma, tomen el screenshot y pónganlo en el grupo, okay? Okay, have a good night, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Teacher, two good little questions. What's up? Hey, how do you pronounce webinar and streaming? Well, what do you mean? How, how do you pronounce webinar and streaming? Oh, webinar, webinar, webinar. Webinar, streaming. Streaming. Yes. That, that's all. Thank, thank you. All right. Have a nice night, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. You. And remember, finish the platform, okay? Okay. Good. Bye. Have a good night. Go to sleep. <laughs>